Hey everyone, it's Ashley, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm just popping on quick to share a Sensi club haul. <laughs> Took me a minute there. Um, I'm doing this right before dinner, so I don't have a ton of time. Um, I'm just waiting for Corey to wrap up some stuff. So I'm just hopping on quick to do that. So if you don't know what Sensi club is, I can leave it linked down below, but essentially my favorite perk of Sensi club is always my bar. So a lot of what I'm going to be sharing is bars that have been, have been discontinued, but I'm still getting them through my Scentsy Club. So let's get right into it. Um, one of, this is my only casualty situation bar. Uh, it's Blue Coconut Beach and it has a little bit of a, it's a little broken on the top. So it doesn't like, it closes, but like not the best. So I'll just warm this really soon. This is a beautiful coconut scent. I feel like I have my select few coconuts I really love from Scentsy. Um, coconut is one of my favorite fragrances if you're new here. So this is one of them. And then I also have Blooming Marvelous, which was the scent of the month from May, I believe. This is just such a pretty floral. This is so pretty. It's just like, I'm not normally a floral fan, but this is so good. So well done. I believe you can probably still purchase this through the end of July, I would assume. Um, it'll probably go away soon. Okay, so next I have Glacier Water. And I need to warm this one because it's been so long. This one, on cold, I'm like, mm. But any time I've ever warmed it, it gets so good. It just like continues developing every single day you warm it. It just gets better and better and better. I honestly am curious how this would also do at work. I feel like it's pretty strong and so like I don't need to bring it to work, but like I'm curious how it would do there and how people would take it there. Um, I have Dumbo Circus Parade, one of my OG Scentsy scents. This is like one of the first scents I discovered. I got it my first order and I've been obsessed with it ever since. So this lives in the club. Sparkling Magnolia. This is another floral that's just so pretty. For some reason, this just makes me think of like an Abercrombie. And I know you're probably thinking like, oh, like cologne. Like it just smells so pretty. And I don't know why it reminds me of shopping at an Abercrombie. But like in what? Like 2010? <laughs> like not now shopping. I don't feel like it smells like this now, but I feel like the Abercrombie at our mall when we used to have one, I, I don't know why this takes me there, but I'm obsessed with it. I freaking love it. <laughs> okay, bakery lovers, birthday wishes. This just smells like birthday cake. Oh, I love, I love me a birthday cake scent. Uh, apple butter frosting. This is getting me in the mood for fall for sure. This is like apples and cinnamon spice vanilla frosting. Really yummy. Hazelnut latte. This is a little bit like borderline coffee, a lot of bakery. So I feel like this one's a little bit more versatile that I don't have to do it only in the morning. I feel like I can do it any time of day and it works, but it's really yummy. Like in the morning, it's perfect, but it is yummy all day long. Definitely it, bakery. You gotta like bakery to like that one. Okay, sugar. This one is just super, super sickeningly sweet sugar. But it's almost got, they say lemon, like hints of lemon, which I do think because it's got like just a little like twist with the vanilla and the sugar. It's so good. I, if you know like pink sugar, like that type of smell, it smells just like that, but yummy, yum, 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 yum. I feel like that hint of what they're, they say hint of lemon or something like that, um, makes it so it's not like super cloying. It makes it a little bearable, <laughs> like more bearable. So you're not going absolutely crazy instantly headache. It's really, really good. Uh, honeymoon hideaway. This is a very just fresh and pretty scent. I love it for the spring summertime. I actually just warmed this in one of my, what I've been warming videos. Toffee Butter Crunch. This is another bakery lovers. This is just like so caramely and sugary. It's really good. Okay, I gotta hurry. Um, this is a newer one to me, Sherbert Lemon. This is from the Harry Potter Honeydukes collection. This is just like a lemon scent. I have Churro Churro. This 
smells like a churro churro I feel like it takes a little bit to get going because like they don't have a ton of smell but it's definitely bakery I love it cutie pie cupcake this is cupcake with like a hint of an orange twist it's just a little bit different from like a birthday cake scent six more I have coconut daiquiri this is actually available now in bring back my bar but I've had this club for quite a while and then vanilla walnut this is just like a vanilla nutty scent actually kind of surprised me I didn't think I would like love it as much as I do but it's just like basic enough that I'm I, re I really do like it it just reminds me of something like my mom would warm um candy crave I feel like this one personally really reminds me of Luna it's just like really sweet and floral like Luna is. It, it definitely has different notes, but it really reminds me of Luna. And then I have watermelon mint, which I actually might swap for the wild watermelon that's currently available. I feel like I might be leaning into that one a little bit more than this one. Like I've had this one for quite a while, so I might switch those out. And then strawberry swirl. This one's kind of like a strawberry milkshake. Yeah, definitely if you're not into like milky electronic scents, you wouldn't like that one. And then Forever Yours, this one, once again, floral, fruity, really, really nice. So yeah, that is everything, but I just wanted to share that quickly in case you guys are interested. So yeah, see you guys next time.